Hey everyone, welcome back to our workout series. Today we're going to be working with bands. So our first exercise we're going to do is we're going to take our band, we're going to grab it in both hands, I'm going to step on it with both feet, so it's going to provide that extra resistance. We're going to do a deadlift, so I want to keep the back and chest nice and tall, core and tight. I'm in a slight squat position, and as I'm driving up, I'm driving up with those glutes, the chest and the hips are coming up at the same time, and then I'm going to lower down nice and controlled. Driving up, squeezing those glutes. Again, we want to drive up with the glutes, pushing through those heels, making sure we're not using that lower back. We're going to do three sets, 10 reps right here. We're going to put that band off to the side. The next one we're going to do is we're going to grab a band that's hooked to either a cable or something you can hook it around. We're going to be in a lunge position. So I'm going to have my left foot forward, right foot is back. I'm going to lunge. And I'm going to have the band in the opposite hand. From here, I'm going to keep my hip nice and stable. And I'm going to draw back in a rowing position. Right here, core and tight. Elbows coming back nice and close to the body. Then we'll switch. And we're going to do it the opposite side. So right foot forward and left arm. We'll do that rowing action. Again, we want to keep the core nice and stable. We don't want to be over rotating, keeping that hip nice and engaged as well. We're going to do three sets, 12 on each arm. Next one we're going to do is we're going to be on our side and we're going to do a side plank. So I'm going to be on my elbow and I'm going to grab that band. I'm going to extend up into a side plank position and row again that arm back, keeping the core nice and tight. We don't want that band to pull us in. So we're trying to counter that band resistance. To make this a little bit harder, I'm going to lift my top leg and do the same thing, rowing back keeping those hips nice and stable and not letting that band pull you in. You'll do that on the left side and the right side, 10 on each arm, three times. Now we're gonna roll over on our back and I'm gonna put the band around my knee and I'm gonna do single leg glute bridges on each side. So whichever leg you're gonna push up with, the band is gonna be around that knee. I'm gonna extend my opposite leg out. I'm gonna engage my core, so belly button to spine, engage that glute. I'm going to lift up nice and controlled, squeezing that glute, hold at the top, making sure that band doesn't pull you all the way out. You're trying to fight that resistance and then lower down. And then lift back up and lower down. We're gonna do 10 on each leg three times. Now we're gonna roll over on our back and I'm gonna extend up into a dead bug, bug position. So feet are gonna be up at 90 degrees with those legs and I'm gonna pull the band up over my chest keeping the core nice and tight. This band is gonna to wanna to fight you back. So you wanna keep it pulled nice and tight. I'm going to lower my right leg while my left leg stays in that 90 degrees and then back. And then we're gonna alternate and back. We wanna make sure that core stays nice and tight. No rounding of the back. You don't want that back to arch. You wanna keep it nice and tucked. We're gonna do three by 10 on each leg right here. And our last exercise, we're gonna be standing back up and I'm gonna have that band and I'm gonna pull it into my body. My feet are gonna be stable and I'm gonna press out and back, out and back. Here we're really working that oblique and that core and we don't want that band to pull us in. We wanna keep everything nice and square straight in front of us. We're gonna do three by 10 each direction. And again, you wanna step out far enough that that band provides that resistance, that it feels like it's pulling you in but you don't want it to, you're fighting that resistance. So those are your band exercises you're gonna to do today. Give this one a shot and I'll see y'all next week. Woo. Okay. Went, went a little smoother. First start off with a <laughs> uh, I don't have to start over, do I completely? Uh, or should I? I'll just yeah, start over. I